Damn, this always happens to me. Camera wants to malfunction when I'm ready to oh, to go. Yeah, but like when when I'm not doing anything, this thing is like so perfect. What it do for life, crew? FTC, flight team stand up. It's about that time for the education list. Just because you guys are back from Thanksgiving break does not mean that shit has died down just as yet, bro. And with that being said, bro, with the uh, generation coming up to the way it is now, there has been a lot of more conspiracies. I don't know what you have to say about this area, but I feel like the teachers have been getting so fun, like, especially like the last three years. Like, oh literally, it's so bad to the point you be thinking, like, why the hell is they being a teacher? Why is it not, like, some, like, public oh. speaker or, like, some other shit? Like, yeah. I don't know, but it also is kind of, like, uh, another thing, too, because, like, you be like, oh, so why are you attacking people, da-da-da-da-da, that, you know, yeah. look pretty? And that was, like, a situation with this one teacher in Georgia, and, like, at first flight through, I was gonna actually report on that, but I didn't know how why everything wanted to go with the privacy and everything. Turns out, she just went straight viral, and it looks like she's probably going to be in this what we're going to be looking at the rich ones again 10 school teachers you won't believe exist man if you guys want to see the full original video it'll be down below in the description but i'm ready to get my mom blown as usual bro. let's get it yeah, yeah, that's what it's a combination of Teachers hate. are some of the most important people to, like, in our world as they educate and mold the future of the world. And there are some teachers who stand out either by defying stereotypes or going above and beyond the call of duty. Here are 10 teachers you won't believe exist. As we hit the books, subscribe to our channel so you never miss a moment on The Richest. Oksana Nivisolaya. Whoa. You might think that Oksana Nivisolaya might Oksana. be an inspiring model Damn. or some sort of social media personality, but her occupation is rather surprising as she is a math teacher in Minsk. Why couldn't she be my math teacher? I ain't average anything <laughs> higher than a motherfucking C in math. I guarantee wow. you I would never have no problem. As soon as I, oh my hey, god. Her body is nice though. Like, I would look forward to coming to her class every single day. Her no skips nice. whatsoever. Belarus. Her social media accounts are full of the teacher posing as a model and looking breathtaking. Why does she do this? Oksana wants to prove to the world that someone with beauty can also have brains. And you can be smart and sexy. While she has yeah. gotten criticism from people yeah. saying she's she a slay. good role model to her students, Oksana keeps doing her thing. Andrew I don't know about you, Eric. You look you like you can be a teacher. A like teacher. when one of those substitute teachers, like a cool substitute. ass substitute teacher that's not on a Friday or Thursday. Thursday or Friday, self next again, because you know that shit comes. But uh yeah, <laughs> you, you definitely like you can you know Maybe. But I'll I don't know for a teacher one day. How your patience is with kids because kids now okay. be on some other next level. <laughs> yeah, shit. like I, I can say probably like back in the day since I got an old soul. Yeah. Maybe I could deal with the kids back in the days, but now these kids be on some like next level shit. You Hell don't yeah. just square up like Ooh, who you telling us? I mean shoot. At Turner High School in Kansas City, Kansas, <laughs> Spanish teacher Andrew Ward managed to make a positive impact on his students with something so simple. Every day, Andrew walks into the door to say buenos dias to his students, and much like Kramer from Seinfeld, when he opens a door, Andrew says the Spanish greeting differently every day. Two of Andrew's graduating seniors secretly took a video of his greeting and made a compilation video at the end of the year to show Andrew how he positively impacted them. Oh, I thought it was something Patrice that I don't know why it's not in my head at first. Patrice Brown is this a fourth grade teacher one. based in Atlanta, Georgia, and she has curves that go on for days. Well, one might think curves. this is an asset. Like, right, like she was born like, like that. And plus, that it, it goes into the diet, like, too. What they want her to wear, like some loose, ugly shit? And it's not even that. Like, it's still going to show her curves, like, exactly. somewhat informed. Like, that's her body. And you she got a real body, too. Hell yeah. Like, this brought the whole world of trouble. This is definitely some hate. As nearly like, any outfit she wears, whether it's a dress or a t shirt with jeans, it is accused of being too sexy. When photos of Patrice went viral, she was nicknamed Teacher Bay, and the term was even teacher. <laughs> but despite getting criticisms, Patrice focuses on her students and is persevered she is bad, yeah. in the incident. Good. Michael Bonner. Most in she North like Carolina, second grade teacher Most Michael shoot. Bonner was looking for ways to motivate his students to pass their upcoming reading test at South Greenville Elementary School. Instead of going the traditional way of offering extra playtime, a pizza party, or even a movie, oh, Michael to told his kids that they could make their oh, own like, music oh, video really if they got popular. Those really used to be the days where we used to have pizza parties. Yeah, and, and movie the, time. Oh, yes, oh, it's, a, it's a certain. That's why I'm saying you look like one of those teachers that would throw those surprise shits. Would. Like everybody get at Somebody least. Somebody get me in their school. Oh my Oh my gosh, dog. For like, real. them things used to make my day in school, bro. I'm trying to tell Once you. Once that was achieved, Michael collaborated with his students to create an epic hip hop music video to celebrate their achievement and to encourage others to reach for the stars. Brandy Young. 
In Fort Worth, Texas, a letter from teacher Brandy Young went viral after she announced to her students and their families that they wouldn't be assigning any homework for the school year. Yes, the I'm only screaming homework for them. the students would have would be any classwork from the day they didn't finish. Hey. Given the homework is synonymous <laughs> she with school, been, this was a pleasant surprise like, for the My teacher? Yeah, really? like... No, no homework? Yeah, like who the like hell? Only, that's what I she want. She got a paper. No, it's being bad like the, the video boy. She got a paper. New homework policy. Like, like where is she? What? Where was she? Come out the fuck school. wherever you are. Yeah. Students, instead of doing homework, like Brandy homework should be like work. To like use the finish your work and then you go home together as a family. Anything. And just be like the kids. Fast. Fast. Nicholas Ferroni. High school teacher Nicholas Ferroni went viral after he found a way to teach sexism and lawmaking when he had his students vote on new ideas, with the majority of the classroom focus group being female and a small number being male. In the real lawmaking world, 80% are men and 20% are women. But this isn't the only thing yeah, that makes Nicholas stand out. He was also difference. named one of the 25 fittest men in the world by Men's Fitness Magazine. Brittany Darris Brittany Darris is a teacher at Rampart High School in Colorado Springs, Colorado, who was devastated to hear that one of her students attempted to commit suicide. After being informed of the incident, Brittany wrote a letter to the student while they were in the hospital, and the student's outlook changed for the better after the reading of the letter. Hey. Realizing the positive oh, impact that her letter made and not wanting to hear about another student wanting to take her own life, Brittany's teachers that really like. They'll, they'll talk down on the kid and tell them they're not yes, going to do nothing, like, but they don't even know what's going chance, on behind closed them. doors. Yes, they don't know, dog, don't know I was a damn victim to that nitpicking shit with the teacher. It was no game. You cannot get away with nothing, and it's everything negative they look at you as, man. And the next like two said, months writing cards to each of her students, all 100 of them. In each letter, Brittany told the student what was special and unique about them, hoping that it would make a positive impact. Christian Foley. Christian Foley is a teacher at the Cardinal Pole School in Hackney near London who has found a way to engage the interest of his students by doing something unconventional, rapping. His students started taking video of his lessons okay. to taught math and That's poetry new. to his kids. <laughs> During moments in between, his class can be heard erupting in cheers. Outside of school, Christian is a well-known person for his work in the contemporary yeah. poetry world Trendy. and even does work as an MC on occasion. Sonia Romero in Albuquerque, New Mexico, Sonia Romero is a kindergarten teacher at Lou Wallace Elementary School, and she goes above and beyond the call of duty. Because she works in an area with low-income students, Sonia goes the extra mile to make sure they're well taken care of. When her students arrive, she asks them if they've eaten breakfast, and if they haven't, she will feed them. Sonia also keeps extra socks on hand, as well as jackets, scarves, toothbrushes, hats, and other snacks. She has even been a foster mother to two former students when they have no place to stay. Sonia's students are certainly lucky you know so, how she feed the kids like, yeah. if, they don't, if they haven't eaten yet in low income neighborhoods. There's a lot of kids like now think about it in schools like every single day yeah, and like, you never know who story. is going. Yeah, everybody got a yeah. story like everything is different everybody as their teacher. Let us know about Whatever your we favorite have a flight crew that education list most definitely had to be one of the more inspiring ones that we have did on this channel, man. Because not only that you just see people can be quick to judge others yeah. just for the way they look, they also can judge them, you know what I'm saying, by other things. And it just goes to show you, man, they prove every single one of these that I've seen, like they proved every one of their doubters wrong. And color like, doesn't mean anything. Hell yeah, that's another thing, a big issue there that people need to get out of their heads. Going into 2017. But as usual, flight crew, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Comment down below out of these top 10 teachers that you won't believe exist. Which one shocked the most? It had to be the Patricia Brown one in Georgia, like I was stating in the beginning of the video. Because, like, that's how her body is. Like, you yeah, can't like, tell. It's just, she's just, Do you want her to chop off her butt? Like, the butt? Yeah, like, anything she wears, she's going to be nice on her. So, deal with it. Exactly. So, I mean, that's just how, I guess, society just pertains to see people yeah. in certain ways. But, hey, man, hopefully it gets better. Dirty dough, baby, dirty lemonade for me. Go and play I, I, four bucks. One for the druggies. One for the druggies. I got nothing for these hoes. And I got nothing for these bitches. Hey there, if you ever get bored of watching people sat in silence, maybe you should come and check out the We Know Nothing podcast, where we talk too much. If you want to listen to two drunk best friends talking about current events, opinions, and embarrassing stories, be sure to check us out.